And topping the runoff ballot will be the city's top job, the race for mayor. According to a local Tea Party official, the real power isn't with the mayor at all, but instead the city manager's office, something he wants to change. Chris 6 News reporter Greg Chandler joins us in the studio with more on this sweeping proposal. Greg? Paulo, Pastor Rick Milby, a local Tea Party conservative, wants Corpus Christi to move from a council and city manager form of government to a system with a strong mayor. He says the way the city government runs now stifles potential growth. Volume of usage. There's no leadership in our city to take the reins and say, let's grow this city economically. Performance report. To find that missing leadership, local Tea Party officials want Corpus Christi to have a strong mayor. If you have a strong mayor, the mayor becomes the CEO of the city. They set the vision. They are responsible. They can hire and fire department leaders of our city. But the city's current mayor doesn't agree. I'd be hard pressed to, to advocate moving to that type of government here in Corpus Christi. Mayor Joe McComb believes in having a strong city manager with the mayor and city council providing guidance. The council is the board of directors and you give direction and you have input and if you don't like the direction you can move the direction or you can change managers if they don't seem to be responsive to the council. Solving problems. In the last 50 years we've only fired one city manager. Pastor Rick Milby wants residents to decide in 2020 through a public referendum, but that's been tried before. Well, the citizens have voted on that twice, I think, in the last 10 or 15 years and overwhelmingly said no. Milby says his plan is gaining momentum and he thinks having a strong mayor will attract stronger candidates. But I think you'll raise up people in our city that'll be visionaries business people who are really intelligent, strong, they love their city and want to see something happen. If the system changes, so will the mayor's salary. Currently, that stands at $9,000 a year. I talked to mayoral candidate Michael Hall earlier today. He told me he would also support the change. But one thing almost everyone agrees on, extending the mayor and council's terms from two years to four.